Body, lift, body, boom. If I'm here, that elbow is available. Shock the body, lift the elbow, shock the ribs, go up for the uppercut. All right, today I'm gonna to show you how you could deal with somebody that's in front of you while you're in a seated position, how you can generate uh, power from your legs for boxing and for grappling. Anytime that somebody's approaching me, I'm feeling awkward. What you wanna do is get that back foot back, okay? So if you look at the chair, I want to step just behind where that leg peg would be. When I'm coming up for the first punch, what I want to do is I don't want to stand up and then punch. Okay, I could probably get knocked over. I don't want to stand up because they press down my shoulder and keep me down. When I come off here, I'm going to transfer my shoulders just slightly ahead of my hips right here. Okay, if I do get shoved back, I can go, I can pivot, I can pivot and get out. But Let's look at punching from here. There's a couple things that are really happening. First of all, you're learning how to generate that low power level in your punching. A lot of people punch from up here in this tall stance. So from here, you're gonna come in, deliver. Body, body, just start off working knees. Boom, boom, good. Boom, notice the knees, notice the knees. I'm turning, one, two. You can then add to that. So once I'm here, one, Two, shovel, right up to the chin jab, there's a strike. So again, turning off the body, body. If I want, I could throw the uppercut, but I don't stand up with the uppercut. I'm in, pop, pop, boom. What I want to do now is be able to dip down and below and outside one of these elbows. So if I'm going from here, first position, body shot, shovel punch, uppercut, dip under, there's my punch, or body, body, up, come under, get out, use your up and overs and so on out here. All right, I'll angle them a little bit better. First one, body, body, up, yep, boom, pop. Or learning to get below those elbows, body, body, up, step, pivot, boom. There, you've got everything from here. If I really want to make this a very effective technique, I'm going to go body, so as I come off, body, lift, body shot, uppercut. Then I could take push-offs and so on. So, again, body, lift, body, boom. See that? Pattern number one for you to really get this one going. This is a great move. If I'm here, that elbow is available. Shock the body. Lift the elbow, shock the ribs, go up for the uppercut. Now I can chin jab this as well. So body, lift, shovel, chin jab right there. Follow up if I wanted to. I can either blast or I can deliver again. Another very good practice from here is if I'm sitting here and I'm going to go through them. Now this time I'm not going to back all the way up here. What I'm going to do is just go from my seated position, sit here. I'm then gonna step through their stance. All right, for this, depending on how you have this weighted, you might wanna just stand on here. If you don't have a lot of weight, if you don't have things in between, you could step through. But as I'm going here, I'm hitting that knee, driving that face, pushing them off. From there, step out, you've got your controls, okay? Got whatever you wanna do from here. Look at this again, so I'm here, I transfer my weight, I'm flat stance, transfer my weight, drive in, projecting them. I'm coming up on that 45 degree angle, uprooting them. Here I go, palm to the ear, whatever, grapples, hooks I want from there. So these are nice, very easy to remember things. Again, one more time, step back, body, body up, or body up, or body pick, body up, all kinds of stuff that you can do. Once you do it though, get back down, get out, okay? Again, body jam, under, drive, you can trap up and over, do anything you want. You now have that control. Let's do it one more time. So I'm in, he's got a problem. I'm putting them back, getting up, standing up on that fourth. Staying in there, good. Those ribs, I'm not really going for the solar plexus. 
I'm going for that floating rib area. So bam, bam. If you just catch those two, you've got a real powerful move right there. Boom, boom, elbow up under. Boom, elbow up under, elbow over. So you've got here, boom, ba, ba. Rhinos are also good. Boom, boom, put them back. A couple things to think about. Try that, let me know what you think. How would you handle it if somebody comes over top of you, they're threatening you? If I stand up, they could press my shoulder back down. What you want to do is transfer your weight. A couple of things you can do. Body, lift, body shot, drive. One. Body, body, up. Two. Our thing. Three. Drive. Mm -hmm.